On Wednesday, the Culinary Union is promising to stage what union members are calling a civil disobedience right here on the Las Vegas Strip outside the Paris. With the big F1 race coming up, culinary union workers still don't have a labor contract. And if an agreement isn't reached, union leader Ted Papa George says they'll call for a strike. And so we're hoping our companies here in Las Vegas um, get on the right track. Uh, but if they don't, I can't see it'll be very much longer. One of those companies is MGM Resorts International, which employs close to 22,000 union workers on the Strip. Culinary union officials were scheduled to meet with MGM representatives today. A scheduled media update early Monday afternoon was pushed back, according to the union. Meetings are also slated to happen this week with Caesars Entertainment and Wynn Resorts officials. Our negotiating committee may, uh, we may make the decision to recommend uh, to set the strike deadline and go on strike. The union, which represents close to 50,000 strip employees, called the ongoing negotiations disappointing last week. Papa George has stated that a strike deadline would likely come before the Las Vegas Grand Prix, which is now less than a month away. The latest rally, which will feature dozens of union members wearing their trademark red shirts, is slated to start at 5 p.m. on Wednesday. Reporting from the Las Vegas Strip, I'm Brian Horwath.